Ian, defeat this afternoon, can you pick that one apart for us? Strange game, um, I actually thought we started the game really well, um, we create two big chances, uh, Brownie goes through one on one, good save by the goalkeeper, Oli Casey hits the post, um, but the difference is I think we maybe had two or three quite good chances in the first half but we there were either good saves or, or we, we hit the post, we didn't take the chance, uh, they had two chances in the first half and were absolutely clinical, um, two great finishes, first one's a good move from them. Um, but I didn't think there was masses in it really. Um, I think we just got caught when, when we found out today that if the pressure's not good on the ball um, and you give a little bit of space and time, you get punished. Um, and of course, then we're chasing the game. Second half, I felt like when Jordan Moore Taylor came off, we had to rejig a little bit. We end up with David Davis in the back three. Um, we, we lose our shape a little bit. And they, they played really well on the counter attack in the second half and, and just caught us on that. Do you feel like maybe then the full-time score does not necessarily reflect what, what happened out there? I mean, they, they, they took their chances. I don't. Th I think they maybe have four shots on on target. They, they scored three goals. They were they were very clinical in front of goal, um, and, and we had chances. We we created chances, but we weren't clinical enough, and that's that's the difference. I think um, they they played a little different to the way I've seen them so far. They did. Normally they they're building up a lot. I think maybe the result on on Tuesday affected that, and they they changed a little bit. They played more direct, and they turned us around a lot. Um, but yeah, I don't I don't think I think we learned a lesson today that that another team will be if we don't take our chances, the other team can take theirs and be clinical, and and that's the level. And obviously that's the the most difficult scoreline to take so far, but. Is there stuff that you can take away from that and be positive about building into a midweek? Yeah, of course. Um, we know we're going to play good teams and we're going to get big challenges. This is a much bigger challenge than, than what we've had before. So uh, we, we understand that. We, we, we don't want it to happen. But at the same time, we, we, we know that we're playing against very good opposition. You know, they were right up there last year. They've strengthened again. Um, they'll most likely be up there again this year. I think there was large parts of the game where I felt like we, we did a lot of good things, but of course some of the, the details we need to tidy up on because some of them weren't good enough.